Welcome back to the channel. My name is Thomas Fletcher and I'm the host of the LCSW Network. If you're new to the channel, please do me a favor by smashing that like button, by subscribing to the channel, and by sharing this video with your social work colleagues and friends. The purpose of this channel is to create a community of hope and support where social workers can come for relevant news, information, and inspiration. Well, welcome back to Self Care Saturday. Welcome back to week 26 of our 2021 Wellness Challenge Series. Do you guys realize we are halfway through the year? Wow, I can't believe it, but we are halfway through 2021. We are halfway through our 2021 Wellness Challenge Series. So how are you guys doing? How are you guys doing as far as adopting and uh, implementing our last 25 weeks of self-care topics into your, into your daily practice, into your lives? Let me know. Let me know how you're doing with uh, with these last 25 weeks of self-care topics. I, I'd really be interested in, in hearing and learning from you all um, about about your experience during the last 25 weeks of the 2021 Wellness Challenge series. So today for week 26, we will be going over one of the components of the Wellness Recovery Action Plan developed by Mary Ellen Copeland, PhD. Um, this component is called the Wellness Toolbox. And again, uh, I've been utilizing, I've been working with RAP as a RAP facilitator since 2014, 2015, and I've been utilizing these concepts in my own life in addition to, you know, uh, facilitating and teaching these comp these uh, components and these um, concepts to my veteran clients. And again, utilizing these, these concepts has been a game changer for me and it really has enhanced my own wellness and my own self-care. So um, today we're talking about the Wellness Toolbox. So let's talk about the Wellness Toolbox. So wellness tools are things you do to keep yourself well and things you do to help yourself feel better when you're not feeling well. Most of them are safe, simple, inexpensive or free and non-invasive. Here are some common wellness tools that Mary Ellen Copeland uh, talks about. Support from others, medical or alternative health care, peer counseling or exchange listening, focusing exercises, stress reduction and relaxation techniques, doing things that divert your attention and that you also enjoy, food and nutrition, exercise, light, sleeping well, modifying your daily life, keeping yourself safe, daily planning, and spiritual beliefs. So these are the common wellness tools that Mary Ellen Copeland um, talks about in, in, in the training of Wellness Toolbox. And if you haven't already noticed, guys, um, all you gotta do is look back at the last 25 weeks and you'll realize these are all wellness tools. And these are all wellness tools that I have experienced utilizing in the past as well as presently. All right, so the great thing about wellness tools are all they have to be is safe, simple, inexpensive, or free and non-invasive. And you get to decide which wellness tools you will incorporate into your wellness toolbox, which tools you will incorporate into the other parts of your wellness recovery action plan. So you guys know I love cycling, so cycling is one of my wellness tools. Um, connecting with nature is one of my favorite wellness tools. That's why I'm out here every week talking to you guys. Um, it's not just a, a beautiful scene, but for me, this is part of my wellness toolbox. Um, I've talked about spirituality, and uh, so spirituality is, is one of the wellness tools that I utilize. Um, I've talked about so many things. I've talked about, you know, the importance of water, the importance of exercise, the importance of sleep, um, the importance of visual arts, you know. Um, all of these things are wellness tools. You know, even the simple things that we take for granted, like, you know, 
taking a shower, brushing our teeth, you know, doing the laundry, you know, washing the dishes, you know, these are things that if we don't do them, we, we, we may be feeling less than well. All right, so that's my challenge for you guys this week to start developing your wellness toolbox and being intentional with it. All right, are you guys up to that wellness toolbox? All right, I want to thank you all for watching this video. For all the social workers out there, thank you for the work that you do every day for your clients, for your agency, and for the profession. Please continue to support each other and yourselves. Bye for now.